hello hi hi hello what is up welcome back to my channel my name is Cammy. Cammy like a tank top um I just finished vlogmas up this is my first video outside of vlogmas just on the normal YouTube video I guess I still have yet to decide on the cadence of YouTube videos if I want to do it like once a month once a week twice a month I don't really know yet but I was cleaning my room today, putting all my Christmas gifts away, and I figured this would be a great time to do a little Christmas haul, show you what I got for Christmas before I put it all away. I have it all out, so this is a perfect time. Um, I will link some of the products below. You can always shop off of my Like to Know It page. I do this just in case you guys are at all interested and don't know how to find these products. I know Christmas is over, but Valentine's Day is coming up, people have birthdays, you can always treat yourself, and I just want to make sure you have the information around you, because I know how much it sucks when you see someone, like something in someone's video or something they're wearing, and you're like, wow, I want that, and then you can't find it. So, just put those there for easy reference. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so, what I got for Christmas, the big kahuna gifts I would probably say that I'm super pumped about is I finally got an Apple Watch. Been using it today. I really wanted it mainly for a fitness tracker. Um, I know there's debate and controversy over if it's a good fitness tracker or not. Um, I know that things aren't going to be 100% accurate. I know that even the machines you use at the gym are not 100% accurate, but I still just wanted a way to track my workout, see how far or fast I was running, um, just a lot of things like that. So that is why I got it. I mean, it's really cool. There's other stuff I can do with it. So I'm really excited to explore more about the Apple Watch. The other, I don't have this with me. I also got AirPods. Ah, I'm so excited. I've been wanting AirPods for a while just because I use it at work, I listen to like podcasts or music, and my phone dies kind of fast, so I, when you have the wire cord, I would have to like use my headphones for a little bit and then charge my phone and I couldn't listen to music, and it just, this is making it so much easier. I also broke my wireless headphones, if you follow me on Instagram, I posted about that. I like was at the gym one day and they just snapped. So, I haven't been able to work out with wireless headphones lately, and it's kind of hard to work out with wired headphones, if you guys know that. I mean, it's totally possible. I'm not saying it's not possible, but I move around a lot of my workouts. I do, like, jump squats. I do burpees, and when I do burpees, I normally have to, like, take those headphones out, do my set of burpees silently, and then put them back in. So, it just... Is going to make my life a whole lot easier so I'm super pumped I want to preface this by saying that every single gift I got I love it was all on my list I'm all super hyped for it um, so there's not like something where I'm like mm, didn't like that or like this was the best gift like those were the biggest in terms of expense um, but everything else I love I love every single gift I got the other big one that I got from Jake actually he got me this like digital photo frame I'm really excited to explore this it like connects with your phone so you can send like your Instagram photos to it and it's like a slideshow you can set it to music you can play videos as in if I bring this to work my vet wedding uh, wow if I bring this to work my wedding video is going to be on repeat so if you are one of my coworkers who is watching this, get ready. What I'm super excited for is I've been wanting to try Glossier for a while. So Santa kindly got me Glossier for um, my stocking. It's a 50% off sale on Black Friday, so Santa went hard on it. So these are the four products that I kind of had like my eye on for a little while that I'm super excited to try. So I have the Brow Fleck pen. Um, super excited to try that. My eyebrows, like towards the end of them, kind of die out. So I want to try and fill those in a little bit. And then I also have the Lid Star 
So it's like an eye glow, eyeshadow thing. So excited to try that. We have the cloud paint, which I have just heard so many good things about it. And I will be completely honest, Instagram video sold me on this. I watched like one of their videos of someone like applying it and it looked so beautiful. And I was like, mm, need that. So I was definitely sold by Instagram. And then I got the Halo Scope, which is their highlighter. And I'm not a big beauty or makeup person, so I've actually never done highlighter before, so I'm interested to try that. And I will let you guys know how these products go. If you are a big Glossier person, um, my favorite person to check in with is Austin. I um, talk about her on my Instagram sometimes, but she is, I think her blog is called Keep Calm and Chiffon On, I think. Um, but she is really great. She has a YouTube channel as well, um, so I'll tag her below. But she has really good reviews of Glossier if you're interested. My dad, seeing the lack of a bar cart I had, he gave me, these are like cocktail decorations. So it's like little candies and like glitter you can put in cocktails. So I'm about to go jazz up some bar cart cocktail things. Maybe. I also, wow, Santa really knows me. Um, I want to do a 2020, I think you guys saw this actually in my Black Friday haul. Anyway, 2020 I'm going to read more. And so I got the book American Royals, which I'm so excited for. And then also Black Friday, How to Train Your Dragon, the full set. This is like the freaking cutest movie Ever. I actually haven't seen, I think I did see the second one, I don't really remember it, but I haven't seen the third one, and Jake's never seen them, and he wants to, so I am so excited. This is something that Jake's mom got for both of us, but it's like a mini fondue, like cheese fondue pot. Um, I'm pretty psyched about this. Jake and I love fondue, we love cheese, so I can't wait to play with this. I'm wondering... It, it specifically says cheese, but I'm wondering if I can probably use it for, like, chocolate. I assume it's, like, the same. So, I might try a cheese and chocolate fondue night. I think that would be so fun. Um, I got a bunch of other kind of random things. I don't want to unpack this, but I got a couple wine glasses, which, obviously, if you know me, I love wine. My mother-in-law knows I love Francesca's. She actually saw, if you follow me on Instagram, I like did a whole shopping haul there just a few weeks ago and she saw this sweater on my feed. And look how cute it is, like this embroidery. Mm, I love this sweater and I'm so pumped for it. Sam's is also great. I think I practiced this in one of my other videos, but the new Acta wear black camo leggings. I'm super excited to try these on. Ooh, that's stuck on them. Look how cute, I don't know if you can really see the detail of these pants, but they look super cute. It's pretty stretchy. I haven't really, the material doesn't seem as soft as I normally go for, but I was just really, really interested in trying these, so Santa graciously bought them for me. Um, if you've never heard of Acta, I really like them. They're high quality material, always squat proof. Like, I don't think there's anything that I've ever bought from them that wasn't squat proof. Um, and what's really cool about them is every time you make a purchase, like literally every single thing you add to your cart, um, you get to pick a charity to donate to. So I think they have, I think it's water, hunger, human trafficking, and mental health, I think are the four. Um, I know in like October they normally add like breast cancer research too. So I will try these on and I will let you guys know how they feel. But I'm super pumped for that. Speaking of fitness, my friend from TCU, Courtney, launched her own yoga mat company. It's called My Soul Mate, Soul Mat, My Soul Mat. Um, and I really loved the avocado one. So I got an avocado yoga mat 
it's like great material, honestly. I don't know, I'm so excited to try it out. Again, I will try it out and give you guys a little review later on. Speaking of avocado, um, first of all, this is the first year I've ever liked avocado. I literally just started eating it back in May. We went to Cancun for our honeymoon and the way they did guac there, I absolutely loved. So I've been, oh sorry, got distracted there. So I've been obsessed with avocado ever since. So I got the avocado yoga mat, an avocado phone case, and this little pop socket thing for my phone that's avocado themed. So big avocado gear. I kept like holding my stuff up like this yesterday and I was like, Jake, I feel like a true like millennial, Gen Z, whatever generation it is, like have my Apple Watch, my AirPods, my avocado, like I'm hip, I'm cool. No, I'm not. I don't know why I thought it would be good idea to hold everything in one hand. Anyway, um, I also got some chapstick, EOS, ASOS, however you say it. This is one of my favorite chapstick brands. It's the only chapstick I will use. Um, I just think it works the best. It hydrates my lips, but it doesn't like leave it feeling chapsticky. I don't know. It's great. Um, ooh, I also got these eye masks, which I'm super excited for. There's four different ones. Um, one is like an aloe vera one, one is like a coconut milk, one is something from like Dead Sea materials or minerals. And then the other one is like golden collagen. I don't know. Um, my friend Morgan of Bun on Done recommended these. I think it's like in her, she links it in her stories, and so I put it on my Christmas wish list. So excited for that. I'm also super excited because I got a jade roller this year, so uh, it just, mm, I feel so good. Can't wait to use this more. My mom got me um, new mascara to try. It's like a primer and a mascara set. And then she also gave me hand and feet masks, which I am so excited for. She knows me very well. Um, so I'm about to have a spa day and it's about to be great. I'm also so pumped because I finally got an ice roller. I've seen it all over Instagram. Again, but Undone totally recommends it. Oh, mine is like frozen, frozen. Um, but yeah, you put it in your freezer and it's supposed to like help wake you up in the morning. So I'm pumped. I'm finally going to make myself a good routine in 2020 because I have my ice roller I have my eye mask and I got my jade roller and like it's just it's gonna be a prime self-care year 2020 is my year but wow I just did that quick motion and it just I feel so good do I look beautiful do I look beautiful I'm about to another thing that I got is a set of 12 pound weights been wanting to do home workouts and I do do them I have like a five pound kettlebell but this is actually the weight that I use at the gym so I can now have pretty good leg days and arm days um, I'm still gonna go to the gym I love going to the gym I really do I think it's much more fun than just staying at home and working out but I do love home workouts for when you don't want to go to the gym, you're unmotivated, but you just got to knock it out or especially heading winter, there's snowstorms, it's cold, it's dark, whatever. I don't have an excuse now. Woo! Excited for it. Okay, here is the Francesca sweater in all its glory. I mean, just, I can't get over that detail and it's literally like the softest thing. It's so comfy. Okay, and here are the Acta camo leggings. Sorry, I'm still wearing a black sweater. It might be a little hard to see because they're pretty black. Um, these honestly don't fit as well as some of their other products. Kind of like the crotch area hangs really low, honestly. And they're not as like stretchy. So maybe that's just on me. 
but they're not as comfortable as their other pairs. They're still like, I really like the material, honestly. They're pretty thick, so it's like nice for like, um, like a winter workout, but I don't know. They're just not as comfortable, so we'll see. I still need to work out in them. They are, of course, squat proof because it's Acta. I don't know if you can see that, but they're squat proof because it's Acta and they have pretty thick material on it, so that's nice. I just wish they were kind of more comfortable and more flexible. Like, they kind of just feel like very structured and this is how they're supposed to fit and I feel like leggings should be a little more flexible to mold to your body. So, we'll see. But, really nice, fun print. I will give them that. Yeah, I think, I mean, there's other stuff that I got or that Jake and I got together. Um, some smaller things, but those are kind of the main things that I had spread out that I wanted to show you before I put it all away. Again, I'll try and link everything below that I can and tag all the people that I mentioned. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys got for Christmas or Hanukkah or whatever you guys celebrate. Um, I would love to know your favorite gift and your favorite, maybe favorite gift that you gave. Um, that, that was a story. I'll tell you that real quick. I was so excited. Jake, I got him like all the things that were top on his list, which was just a bunch of video games. But I got these like game cards from Target and they look just like gift cards. But they didn't tell me that I needed to keep the receipt because the code to use these little game cards and download the game would be printed on the receipt. No one told me that. So I got rid of the receipt because we lived together and it was Black Friday so we were shopping together and I didn't want him to know and no one told me to keep the receipt. So then he he's like trying to download them yesterday and he's like, oh, where's the receipt? I need the receipt for the code. And I was like, what? So basically the gift I gave him is completely useless and we have to go buy new ones. So that kind of sucked. Um, always keep your gift receipts is what I learned and what I'm going to tell you so this doesn't happen to you. But it was still a really great Christmas. Um, everything's taken care of. It's all fine. Um, but yeah, that kind of sucked. Anyway, I hope you had a really good holiday. Or if you are still celebrating, I hope you have great holidays. Um, I just want to show you what I got. So thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And if we're still in the giving spirit, I would love if you would share this video with someone you think might enjoy it. Hint, hint, a boyfriend or a parent to hint at maybe a gift you want. Um, but yeah, just the more you can share, that would be absolutely amazing. And I love you guys so much. So thanks for watching.